demo. When you first open this app, what you'll see is a list of the resorts at the Walt Disney World um, parks. Now, you see that these are ordered by the type of resort. On the left-hand column, you see Val for value, Mod for moderate, Ville for villa, etc. You can scroll through up and down. When you tap on one of the resorts, you'll come into this summary page. We have lots of interesting details. Um, up here at the top, you see the name of the park, I mean the resort. The average review in stars, who we have four stars for the Caribbean Beach Resort. How many reviews that's based on, which is 10 in this case. How many pictures we have of the resort, which is 72. And you have uh, the beginning of the description of the resort. Now, if you tap on this description, you'll come up and see a full description of the resort, which you can scroll through at will. Um, by hitting the back button, you can get back to the main summary page. And below that, you'll see a list of member reviews. Uh, these are ordered by date, so the top of the list will be the most recent review. And you'll have the number of stars, who wrote it, the date, title. And if you tap on the, on the uh, review, you'll get a detailed uh, display showing you the complete review. Again, hitting your back button will take you back to the summary page. Now at the top, you see we have a nice little action bar. There's a home button. This will take you back to that original screen. And the new features for Resort Researcher 2.0 is uh, mapping. So here where you have a map pin button, you can tap on this and it will bring up uh, a map showing where the resort is located. And you can move around on this map as you normally would um, by dragging it. Um, pinch zoom will probably also work depending on your device. And you also have these zoom in and out buttons at the bottom if you tap on it. Or you can double tap on it to do an automatic zoom in. Again, hitting the back button will take you back. Um, now we also have a pictures button, which will show you the pictures. Now it may take a moment or two to download all the pictures. You can see the progress bar at the top. And again, you can scroll through the pictures. You can often do pinch and zoom to zoom in and out. Or again, double tapping should take you in and out. Um, like so. Uh, again, hitting the back button will take you back home. Now these little, this button with the five stars on it, this is actually to write your own review. Of course, we always appreciate it when you put in a review for uh, your own experiences. Uh, it's always good to put in some real detailed information in there for your other users to enjoy. And these are shared amongst both the iPhone and Android apps. The I button here, of course, takes you to an information page where you can watch this demo, uh, contact our support team, or even write us a review. And again, we always appreciate it if you write a nice review for this app, if you're really enjoying it. Uh, it helps uh, spread the word. This app is brought to you as a joint effort between Laughing Place apps and OurLaughingPlace.com. Um, you can contact uh, OLP Travel at OurLaughingPlace.com if you'd like to uh, make a uh, reservations or find out more information about traveling to Disney. Finally, we have our calculator button. This is a calculator feature where you can calculate the price according to room rack rates of a stay at Walt Disney World. And of course, this version two has uh, the new 2013 room rates. Uh, you can select first the number of nights that you plan to stay, uh, what the start date of your visit is. And of course, you can do 2013 here. And then you go and select your room, depending on the resort. Let's say I want preferred, and voila, it figures out $201 for a one night stay. September 24th, preferred room. And again, you have links to pictures, reviews, and you could share this with a friend. Send it to them by email if you want to show them a nice rate that you found. So let's go back to the home page now. Uh, we also have a map button on the home page here. And what this does is takes you to an overall map of the entire Walt Disney World Resort. These green circles being resorts, of course. 
Um, as usual, you can double tap or use the plus and minus zoom buttons. Now, if you tap on one of these resorts, it'll bring up the name of the resort and the type of resort. Um, so you can go around and just kind of see what these different resorts are. And if you want more information, you can tap on that little bubble and it'll bring you right to the summary page where we were before. Uh, if you want to go right back to the main home list, hit the home button and there you are. Now, you can also search for resorts by resort name. Simply tap on this search box and type in the name of the resort. Let's say I want to find All Star. So I go AL, usually one or two letters, maybe three, will bring up a list. And again, you can tap on it um, to go straight into the summary. I'm not going to do that here. Uh, you'll notice that we still have the summary of number of stars, average review, number of reviews is in this small parentheses here, six in the case of All Star Movies Resort. Now, if you are uh, done with that, you can always um, delete your input using the delete key and hit the back button to put the keyboard away. And there you are. I hope you've enjoyed our little demo of our brand new Resort Researcher version 2.0 for Android. Thank you very much.